Hey guys, Flair with a Verge. We're here at Samsung's Unpack 2012 event taking a look at the Galaxy S3. It has just been launched. It's a quad core device, has a 4.8 inch Super AMOLED HD display, that's 1280 by 720 resolution. Uh, it matches the HTC One X in that respect. It also matches it in terms of screen size and general dimensions. So we're just going to try and take a look at them. Uh, it's a size comparison right now, actually. Uh, both of these phones uh, run Ice Cream Sandwich, Android 4.0, but both of them have skins on top. So there's Sense 4 on the One X, and uh, I, I believe it's still called TouchWiz with Samsung. But it's a it's an upgraded, it's a new skin. Um, they're trying to go with a more natural user interface, so they say it's been inspired by, inspired by water and pebbles and leaves and all sorts of natural themes like that. Uh, part of the unlocking process with the Samsung is actually um, this whole idea of you essentially dabbing your finger into water, which you can take a look at now. Uh, it's not particularly intuitive, you don't really know when you've done enough to unlock it, but it's there. Uh, if we take a look at the window shade menu up at the top, it's still quite familiar for Samsung Touch Reader users. You have a bunch of uh, launcher icons at the very top, then you have your notifications underneath, uh, ongoing items uh, which you can swipe away presumably. Yeah, that's uh, very much like uh, the standard Android 4.0. So you're going to see a lot of the standard Android 4.0 features in there, but you're going to be buried under a lot of Samsung customizations, which not many people are going to love. Uh, but we'll give them a chance. A lot of these software features we'll need to try out um, in more depth to get a good idea of how they're going to work. Uh, as you can see down at the bottom, uh, you, know, you don't get the free software keys as you do with Google Stock Android. You have two capacitive and one physical home key. Um, and in terms of physical um, accoutrements on this device, you have a 1.9 megapixel front-facing camera at the top. Uh, you have all the usual sensors next to it very thin bezel on the sides this is why it also doesn't feel like such a massive phone um, over here on the side on the left side you have the volume rocker it's a pretty thin phone as you saw with the size comparison with the one x uh, going all the way around to the back uh, it's a plastic back cover it's not the best it kind of reminds us of the original galaxy s you have an 8 megapixel camera backside illuminated sensor led flash and a speaker grill on the back and the power button is mounted on the right side usual place and usual place for Samsung that is and then you have a headphone jack at the very top so that's it our first look at the Galaxy S3 with Samsung uh, it's launching on the 29th of May in Europe and it should be coming to the United States with LTE in June